Welcome everybody into this new tutorial of this amazing application from the MetaMask Business Manager. And now I'm pretty sure it's been called as Meta Business Suit. So if you are into the Facebook.com business section, you're gonna see that uh, you have to go into the platforms and products and go into the Meta Business Suit. You may want to side in before we continue. So as you can see, here's the overview of what is Meta Business Suit. So this is an amazing tool that we can centralize Facebook and Instagram inside uh, this great tool. So what you guys want to do is to get started in here. I'm gonna scroll a little bit down so we can get started. And I'm gonna visit Meta Business Suit on my desktop by clicking on this link. And I'm gonna click in here real quick. Now, as you can see, it's going to be redirecting me into my business suit where I've already signed into my Facebook account. So as you can see, I have just a few uh, accounts already opened here. I have my Facebook account and I already have my Instagram. Both of them are already opened. So I can manage both of them here in the business suit. So as you can see, we have the home section, notification section, where you can see all the notifications, whether that will be from the Instagram or the Facebook notifications. We can go back. Here's your inbox. The same as the notification we can check out in here from Facebook and Instagram as well. If you go into the content section, we can see all the content that we have published and schedule uh, along from all my Instagram account here. And what I can do is to go into the planner section. The planner section is actually really great. So if you're trying to spend a little more time in here into the business facebook.com, you can always put here uh, and a specific post so you don't have to be every single day uh, checking your checking your social so for example here I don't so for example here as you can see I didn't have anything on the 4th of July so let's say I don't want that to happen again so let's say for example that this is the best sound that we can put in here as you can see this is like a little star now I'm gonna scroll a little bit um, I'm gonna zoom here it says recommendations are based on when your followers were most active uh, in the last seven days so let's say I want to create a post here for 8 p.m. I'm gonna click in that and as you can see here's the date that's gonna be posted and the time so the optimal times that will be for today for tomorrow and the Saturday let's get into today and go into save now it's going to be asking me where I want to publish my post. That will be from the Instagram, Facebook, or both of them. But in my case, I'm just going to go ahead and select the Instagram. It's right in here. As you can see, we can put in a text and some media so we can start creating our post real quick. So let's say, for example, I want to add a photo. If you want to, you can use a template here from Vmail. But in my case, I won't do that because I wanted to make a first post in here. So I want to add a photo here. I'm going to add that from my desktop in here. So I'm going to be choosing this one. And here in the text, let's put something into coming soon. This uh, August 2022. So after that, let's if you want to put a location, you want to do that uh, in here. If you don't, you can leave it like that. And after that, you can schedule the poses, uh, how it's going to be looking here is now it says to be scheduled here as you can see we've already placed the time and just clicked into schedule the post in here so it says this may take a while and now as you can see i want to go a little bit back so if you go back into the content section you can always go into the schedule section and you might see that our post is not being ready for being published in here as you can see here's the privacy and the status is not boosted yet this is only for making advertisement in here and of course, we use the ads section where we can manage our ads. As you can see, there are a few of my ads, uh, the reach of the people, the links, clicks, the amount that I spend here on my ads. Uh, if I want to take a look in the specific um, result, I can go in here. It says view results. going to be redirecting me into the ads manager so I can take a look much more uh, faster and more detailed about that. I'm going to close this just for a second and I'm going to go into the insights. Now, speaking about the insights, it's going to show me everything, every activity, my results, the audience growth uh, from my Facebook and the Instagram. Both of them are going to be here into the business manager. So I'm going to go into show later. As you can see, this is the overview. You can set a goal if you want to. If I go into get started, let's say I want to grow followers in 28 days. I want to go into next. And as you can see, the goal from my Instagram 
um, is to gain 76 followers in, in the next 28 days. If you want to do this a little bit intermediate, as you can see, 20% high, higher. So I'm going to go into set my goal. And it's going to be appearing in here, grow audience. So I can view my progress, which is right in here. This is my latest uh, numbers of my followers from Instagram and the likes that I have from Facebook. So as you can see, I have a lot of uh, audience reactions here into my Instagram account. And I can see here the top cities and the top countries. And lastly, you have this one that says all the tools. So you can see what you can do for engaging your audience, for creating advertised, for managing your account, for analyze and report and obviously for selling products and service just in, just in case you have a business and you want to uh, take a look at your products and the service you've been selling. So as you can see guys, it's really easy and it's really great that we have this meta business suit uh, that's quite new here. And as you can see here into the home section, we can see the recent stories, the recent ads, how my audience has been growing. And as we just saw here into the insights, we can create our new uh, plan with goals here so we can grow our audience if you, in case you want to reach more people, for example, here. So now that we know how to use the business facebook.com, we can start right away. Just in case you have any specific question about this uh, platform, you can always go into this health section and go into the uh, give feedback. If you want to go into the business manager, this is like the old version. You can switch back. You can put in here your feedback if you want to. If you are not used to the Meta Business Suit, uh, after I clicked on that, it's going to be sending me back into the business, into the business manager that was uh, the old one. So uh, you can always do that. For example, I want to go into help once again. And as you can see, here are the recommended articles and the additional resources just in case you have any question about each, each specific data here from your business Facebook account. And now lastly, like we are into the old section, you can always go into the users so we can hit into the people section and we can add uh, some administrators here. You can add editors, uh, developers here. You can add, let's click in here. You can enter an email so they can have access like an employees. If you have like an account uh, for your business and there's more people involved into your project, you can always put it in here so you can give them administration access in here so you can add a few uh, tools more of a few tools here of the analyst editor or developer here depending on your business in here so as you can see this so you can either choose the new version from this business manager or you can always stay with meta business settings in here that totally depends to you either way you will have all the tools here into the uh, business application you have the ads manager you have the events manager your business your building your media and your audience activities all in one so you can do everything from just uh, this page so you can optimize your your ads your account and your page uh, from Facebook and from Instagram as well so let me know guys if you have any question don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about the business meta suit here into business manager from facebook thank you for watching this video and i'll see you next time